show. Julian from Humble, Texas has a question about an AC clog. It's a familiar problem, Tom. Julian writes, my AC unit's drain tube is clogged and the drain pan fills up. Man, I feel your pain, Julian. I poured some liquid plumber down the breather, but that didn't work. What should I use to get this thing unclogged, Tom? When you call an air conditioning contractor out to unclog the drain, that's going to be uh, your emergency or your primary overflow uh, drain line from your evaporator coil. Most of them will use compressed air. They will have bottled air with a little hose and they'll stick it in there and they'll try to blow the, the, the air down in there with a lot of pressure and try to, uh, to uh, break the blockage up and then let it go ahead and go down the drain because it's usually a bunch of mold and, and this green sludge that kind of grows up, grows in these things. And so that helps. When you put something down there, liquid plumber, I guess would work for it to a point, but that's more for plumbing clogs in P traps. And that's where you always see it advertised right there at the P trap. And this is a different type of clog. Bleach on a regular basis will kill all that growth in there. And sometimes that's all it'll take is a little straight bleach. But sometimes it gets so bad that even the air conditioning contractors can't get it unclogged. It happened to me and it gets clogged down the line. And that's when you call in a plumber, believe it or not. And they have snakes that they'll run down, even those little lines. And sometimes they have to get in there and do some real cleaning to keep uh, to avoid this from happening. So once in a while, if you pour a little bleach down there, you don't have a problem, you avoid a problem, that works. Once it's clogged so bad that it keeps reoccurring, that's when usually the plumber needs to come out and not only do that little drain line, but trace it all the way to the sink and out to make sure it's totally clean. And you're not just partially unclogging it for a little bit and then it clogs back up. And that's what it sounds like it's doing to you. It's interesting you say that. We have that issue here in the lavish home show oh, radio office tower. Yeah. Our two-story office tower. Yeah. Um, yes. our, our, our system will do that from time to time. And Chad yeah. will sometimes go up and <laughs> give it a oh, blow. No. Yes. Uh-huh. And, and that'll clear it out. You you don't you don't suggest doing the the blow th fix. I said this once before. Chad's wife heard it. She assured me that he's still kissable afterwards. But putting your lips on something that dirty, you can. I've had people call me on the show where people have done that and gotten all kinds of fever blisters and stuff. That's some pretty gross stuff. But Chad assured me. He covered it with a sanitary cloth first. So the only reason I, I cringe is I don't want any of my listeners coming down with fever blisters all over their mouth. But yeah, the air pressure helps a lot. And if it's small and it's close to the unit, it'll work. But if it's down line farther, he can blow all he wants. It's not going to blow that far. We want our, we want our MacGyver <laughs> to survive. Yes. But all right. He's a MacGyver. He's not the, uh, you know, just a regular guy. Yeah, if you're not sure who to call, a plumber or whoever, go ahead and click on call the Chad. blue Ask Tom button or call <laughs> Chad. No, you can't have Chad. He's all ours. But click on the blue Ask Tom button and fill out this form and send us a picture because it helps us do a good job. And uh, that's what we want to do. There you go. I'm not running the show today, so i got to <laughs> – look, Mom, no hands. Anyway, little, um, okay. it's taking a little getting used to. And so you remember when you took your kids for when they got their learner's permit and you took a first drive? Remember when they drove for the first time? I made my children go to driving school. I did not want to teach them myself. I That's one thing after <laughs> teaching them how to ride a bicycle. I said, I'm dropping you off here. That guy's going to do it. I ain't doing it. And they yeah. did okay. <laughs> well, I only taught one of my kids kids to okay. drive. The others all took driver took they sent it to classes because yes, I think because there's a there's a downstream effect. He has said to the others said, "Ah, oh, we want to go this way." All right, exactly. Anyway, we want we post a new one of these and sometimes talk about home improvements too, and we post them every day yes. on the Home Show Radio YouTube channel. And of course, you'll find that these and lots more useful info at homeshowradio.com.